For a reason unbeknown to me, I thought it would be a fun challenge to wake so up at 5 a.m. every single day for an entire week. So, come along for the ride and see how it went. Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. If you are new to my channel, hello, I'm Jordan. Um, it is currently Sunday night and it is 11.01 right now. And as you've seen by the title, I will be waking up at 5 a.m. every day this entire week. Why I'm doing it, I don't really know. I don't know what possessed me to want to try this challenge, but I am a morning person and I do usually wake up like kind of early, like 7 o'clock, 7.30. So I thought that this was probably doable. Ultimately, I would like to start waking up earlier. So I felt like this challenge would be a good kickoff for that. Another thing is that this video will hold me accountable because I'm actually like documenting it. But yeah, I need to get to bed because I have to be up soon and I don't nap. So let's get ready for bed and see you tomorrow morning. Good night. See you bright and early. Uh -oh. Good morning. <laughs> it's so early. I'm tired. I've never looked worse. <gasps> in my room right now are so peaceful I'm loving it I still look extremely puffy but what can you do it's literally like 5 30 um, I just cracked open a Celsius because I drink Celsius every single day and I need the caffeine I'm gonna just sit at my desk and try to whip out some editing and just chill Well, it's freezing, but it's so peaceful, and I can hear all the birds chirping. A bit of time has passed. It is currently 5.13, and I just wanted to do a little check-in because I've now officially been awake for 12 hours. I'm feeling totally fine right now. Like I'm not tired, but I think I'm gonna crash pretty early tonight because I just usually sleep longer. Um, yeah, so far so good. The hardest thing is getting out of bed, but I'm, I'm doing well. I skated, I worked out. I mean, granted my caffeine intake today was absurd, but you gotta do what you gotta do. It is 11.37 p.m. I'm wide awake right now. Like my mind, my mind is moving a thousand miles a minute. So hopefully I can fall asleep, but I will see you tomorrow bright and early for day two.
I don't know why I thought this would be a fun challenge. I am struggling. Oh my gosh. I like barely can open my eyes right now. Day two is definitely harder than day one, but I also got less sleep last night. I was like tossing and turning all night and I woke up at like three o'clock. That's how the cookie crumbles, I guess. All I know is that I'm gonna need a lot of caffeine today. <laughs> Your girl is struggling a lot worse than yesterday, but I think it's because I didn't sleep as well as night one and I also didn't sleep as long. That would make sense why I'm crashing really really hard right now i mean maybe i seem like high energy to you but for me i'm i'm struggling a little bit so i think i might want to make an iced coffee because i mean do i have to explain myself no Cheers, everyone. Pinky's up, you know the drill. And I'll see you for bedtime. It is 11.21 p.m. I'm not doing myself any favors because I have to be up at five, but I'm actually looking forward to waking up early tomorrow, whereas this morning I was dreading it. Tomorrow morning may be a different story. We will cross that bridge when we get there. I'm going to head to bed and I will see you once again bright and early at 5 a.m. on the dot for day three. Good morning everyone. Welcome back. It's another day. It is 5 a.m. Like actually what time is it exactly? It is 5.08 a.m. My hair is comical right now as well, but I literally just woke up. Yesterday I meditated for a little bit and it was really nice, so I think that's how I'm gonna start my morning. Oh my god. I look so tired right now, but I feel fine. I just look like crap. <laughs> It is currently 10.52. I have been on Clubhouse chatting for the past like three hours, which is crazy. We have them every single week at 7.30 on Wednesdays and they're just so much fun. Like today was my favorite chat of all time and I totally meant to go to bed earlier because your girl was struggling this afternoon. I mean, I literally fell asleep laying on my floor, my kitchen floor at that, but yeah. I'm gonna head to bed now and hopefully get a good six hours of rest and then I'm ready to go tomorrow. So I did not sleep well at all last night. I had like three different nightmares. I honestly haven't had a nightmare in so long and I think it's because I ate right before bed. <laughs> but I mean, I was hungry. You girls gotta eat.
I need to get to bed because I have to be up in five hours and 20 minutes on the dot. Time to go to sleep. I've done my skincare, got my retainer over there on deck. So, buenos noches y hasta mañana. Why did I do this? I'm so tired. Clearly, I have a face mask on right now. It is Friday night. It's like 11, 11 o'clock. And I've had a really good day. I didn't really document any of it because it was so busy, but um, Mariah just left not too long ago. She came over for a little bit of wine and we watched a new show. Yeah, I guess I'm getting up tomorrow at five again. I'm gonna go to bed and I'll see you guys tomorrow morning in the same exact spot. We're almost there. We're at the home stretch. So toodaloo and see you in a few hours. Good morning! It's Saturday morning. I really look rough. I need to wash off my face, so let's go do that. I've been putzing around with my hair trying to make it look cute, but it's just not possible because it's 5 a.m. And you know what? I don't care. This is what we're working with. It's what you're getting. I actually didn't have trouble waking up today. Like, I think today was probably the easiest day to wake up. I did not even fall back asleep once. It is a Saturday and I don't really have like a ton of things planned, but I want to be really productive with filming and editing. So I am happy that I'm up early. My stomach is a bottomless pit, truly. So I'm gonna go downstairs and make a snack because I'm already hungry. <laughs> is now at 10 29 p.m saturday night i just got home i was out for a little bit and i'm exhausted so i'm gonna get ready for bed i'm gonna take my makeup off put my jammies on so let's do that now voila i'm gonna get some rest i will see you tomorrow for the final 5 a.m wake up call i am so excited to be done with this challenge <laughs> Good night. So this was the final day of waking up at five and I failed. I set like five alarms like I usually do, but I'm just so tired from this week. It's been a busy week and I did not wake up until my six o'clock alarm. I wouldn't consider it really a fail though because 6 a.m. is still pretty early. I feel like people only do this Monday through Friday and I did Monday through Sunday. So if you look at it that way, I didn't fail at all. It's Sunday afternoon and I just wanted to end this video. I can't believe I actually stuck with it and woke up at 5 a.m. every day or attempted to, I should say, because technically today I woke up at 6. But I definitely feel like I have a new body clock. So even though I couldn't fall asleep earlier, I was able to get up earlier, easier every single day. 
I mean like I was tired every day I woke up but once I was up and out of bed I was totally fine so I think moving forward I'm gonna start waking up around 6 6 30 and I'm really excited about it but I hope you guys enjoyed this video love you all to bits thank you so much for watching thank you for supporting me and I will see you in my next video bye guys